Happy Friday everyone, it's Nazi here and it's time to play some Back to the Future, the game. Continue. This is us loading the game. I guess. <laughs> Hope you're all doing fantastic. I'm doing pretty darn well. Whoa. Okay, good. I, I was like, where are you loading me from, game? So, hi everyone. Marty's trying to wave, but he can't. Hey guys, how's it going? Thank you so much to everybody for your huge response to my previous video, my previous Back to the Future video. I'm glad you enjoyed it so much. It was super fun and uh, I'm going to play more. A few things I've learned from the comments section in the previous video is to use a mouse, which I'm going to do because you guys were completely right. I would have found those amp controls so much faster if I had been using um, a mouse. So I'm now going to use a mouse. And, um, and yeah, let's just rock and um, let's find out what's in this a DeLorean uh, over here that suddenly is back from looks like it's from the 19 uh, well it's, it's from the it's the 2015 um, right is that what year it was when he went to the future because it's got a Mr. Fusion there at least so let's see what's going on in the Doc? DeLorean careful Marty careful son Shit, man. Careful now. It's cold. You knew that. Why do you seem to have forgotten? Oh, shit. Einstein. Where do you come from, boy? Didn't you bring Doc with you? Jesus, there's a dog in there. Goddamn mutts. Keep these mutts out of my car. It was, of course, uh, Doc Brown's dog, uh, Einstein. Oh, he's reminiscing. What is shoe? Was that his mother's okay, shoe? Doc, I know I haven't seen you in a few months, but I'm pretty sure this isn't your shoe. Yeah. Oh, a tape recorder. That's probably gonna have. To, that's probably plot. Let's see. Um. I can use those to enter a date into the time circuits. I know. We know. We know what's going on. Oh. Marty, if you're hearing this recording, then the DeLorean's automatic retrieval feature is a resounding success. Automatic retrieval? In case of my failure mm. to return to the DeLorean within an allotted time, I programmed the time machine to jump to these four dimensional coordinates without me. Huh. As you are well aware, time travel is an inherently risky activity, and despite my elaborate precautions, there's always the possibility that I could land in trouble sometime. And that sometime is now, or then, or <laughs> maybe later. He's in trouble. Marty, you come to my rescue in the past. Or oh, was it the future? Anyway. I'm relying on you to do it again. Please take the wow. DeLorean back or, or forward to whatever it is I'm stuck in time. When you get there, I'm sure you'll figure out what to do. That's mm. it? Aren't you going to tell me when that is? Just go to the date specified on the time circuit readout under the heading mark Last Time Departed. Good luck. Yeah, right. right. Yeah. Last Time Departed. Last Time Departed. Uh, oh, you know, geez. that was an episode of uh, Star on, Trek on. once. I've got a guy whose time machine Crap. went back in time oh, without great. him. It was a really good episode. How are we supposed to find him now? Yeah, how are we supposed to find him? Hmm. What? I've got my inventory. The shoe! The shoe will tell me what to do! I'll hit, hit that with a shoe. Oh, fuck. I don't think hit so. that with a shoe? Hit this with a shoe? Not. I'm gonna hit everything with a shoe. Hold on. Einstein with a shoe. Einstein! I'm gonna hit you with a shoe, bro! What do you know about this shoe, Einstein? Oh! <laughs> Great Scott! I think he's onto something! Oh my god. What, seriously? I am so good at puzzle games. Oh yeah! Marty, cool as heck, as usual. Cool as okay, guy. Now we're getting somewhere. This is supposed to lead me to Doc, Einie. Come on, Einie. Come on, Einstein. Okay. Oh, yeah. Buzzer. Who's on the buzzer? Oh, Strickland. That's the uh, headmaster. For the Step school. Away from the door. Ah. Now, let me get a look uh -oh. at you. Einstein, bark, come on. bark, Mother Hubbard. Just as I suspected. Hooligans. Hmm. 
Um, I'm no hooligan. I'm not a hooligan, ma'am. I'm a, a teenager. I wasn't born yesterday, young man. You certainly were not you born the yesterday. Who skateboards through the town square every morning between eight and eight thirty in a decidedly unpunctual manner? <laughs> It's quite good because she's the uh, principal's mother, I guess. It's a fact. Look it up. Who are you? Strickland. You aren't related to uh, Vice Principal Strickland, are you, ma'am? Not that it's any of your business, but I'm his sister. Ah. Oh, and you're one of those McFly slackers, aren't you? What? Yes. Uh, what's old man Strick? I mean, what else has oh. your brother been saying about me? Nothing I couldn't have deduced for myself, slacker. How rude. Uh, I'm not going to tell her the dog brought me here. She's not going to care at that. I've got hey, something for you. In. I've got something to show you. It's a knuckle sandwich. It? Let me see. Um, what have I got? Give it, <laughs> give it a flipping shoe. Here you go. A shoe? Wow, now what would I want with a... <gasps> Stay there. Okay. She must really love shoes. Oh. Match is a pair. Snap. Snoo snap. Snoo snoo snap. Shoe snap even. Jesus. Bite your balls off, Leave Einstein. Creature outside. Okay, fine. Sorry, Einstein. Einstein. Soy bro, take one for the team. Just like Eugene or whatever the hell Fr Fry's dog was called. Sit down, son. Comment section Boy, if you know that reference. Future Emma. Enough. Um, there's a lot of stairs. To return the shoe, I mean, I lost it ages ago. Hmm. You can put it down next to the other one. Mm, much better. So Why would she keep one shoe? Nah, I suppose you'll be wanting some sort of reward now. No, I... All I've got is tea and candy. Whoa! I'm Hell yeah. Sorry I called you a tea and woman. candy? I try not to jump to conclusions, but after all, nine out of ten people in this city are hooligans. It's a Look fact. up. Look it up. Look it up, bro. Look at that sweater she's wearing. Holy shit. That is the nicest cat uh, sweater I've ever seat, seen in my sonny. life. Wish I had a cat sweater like that. I haven't got any cat clothes or any sweaters, actually. Hey! You kids! Put out those cigarettes! Uh, Alright, let's, uh, let's have a look around her apartment without her permission. Oh, photos. Let's see who's this guy. <laughs> is that... Vice Principal Strickland? Mother never dress? could keep little Gerald out of her clothes. He was born bald, it seems. Look at this cat statue. Look at this cat lamp! Oh, my flippin' lord. Oh, man, I bet you one of these newspapers. Oh, she's got cats. Look, she, there's a cat thing here. Look. Oh, cat balls. Where's the cat? Oh, <gasps> I wouldn't do that oh, if I were you. It's not a very nice Pretty cat. Whiskers is very particular about who handles her food. <laughs> Miss F Miss Pretty Whiskers, bloody love me. Man, and, like the cat whisperer. Here. Well, that's the kettle. I'll be right back with some tea. And don't touch anything. Wrong. Gonna touch everything. And then we're gonna lick everything as well. And you, I'll lick one thing and not, and I'll tell you I licked something, but I, I won't tell you what thing I licked. So then you think I licked looks older everything. Than I am. Newspaper. Here we are. I bet you there's one with Doc in it or something. Like Doc's just sitting on a newspaper somewhere. Juveniles collide with manure truck. Here we are. Nice picture. That's a reference. There's a reference. Comments if you get the reference. What else can we do here in this room? Wait. How, oh, I don't know the control. Hold on. How, how do? How? Game is paused. Ah yeah, oh, shit. The water still hasn't come to a boil. Right, hold on. We're going to see if I can work out the controls here. Uh, I want to know the control. It's not that one, right? It's not that one. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Caps lock. The one that shows me all the points of interest in the section. It's not that one. 
just randomly pressing all the buttons on my keyboard. Press, 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 alt. No, it's not that one. Uh, shit. Nearly pressed the stop recording button. That would have been bloody hilarious. What button is it? Right, I'm going to have to go in there. Get that. Don't you talk to that woman. Don't you talk to that woman, Marty. God damn it. Um, right, what we got up here? Cat trophies. What are these? My editorial trophies. Oh, snap. That lover's quarterly. It's legitimate journalism. Heck yeah, it is. The best kind. Shoes. Einstein brought me that shoe from the past. But when in the past? Hmm, good question, Marty. Kitchen door, have a look in the kitchen. All good. Uh, Miss Strickland, how about your tea? Uh, you forgot to turn on the... You illiterate <laughs> uh, So he's like, he's graffitiing, but he's typoed it. Right, what am I doing? Let's speak to Edna, shall we? I'm not, I'm not missing anything, am I? Hence, story stuff. What I would like. Ah, here we are. Settings. Controls. Where is it? Controls. Advanced. Uh, I can't change the controls. I can't even see them. Shit. No, I didn't just change the resolution. Jesus, that would have been a nightmare. Sound, subtitles, and help. Right, screw it. I can't change the controls. At least while I'm in a game. Edna, let's chat, baby. Uh, Miss Strickland? Jack! Diane! I know what you're doing behind that tree! Jack and Diane. Yes. Um... Nice binoculars. Doing some stargazing? No, I set my sights on the lower things. What? Is that? Peeping Tom. Peeping Jean. Tiff Tannen! Get away Tiff Tannen. from the before I call your father! Oh, wow. That's what they named the kid? Holy shit. What a great name. Um, what, when did you lose the you shoe, when you lost baby? Shoe? shoe? That shoe over there. Oh, that shoe! Huh. Hi, what a nosy Nelly! No one likes a busybody, you know. Hey, but... I'm oh, just being friendly. Fine. Let me think about it. Uh, yes, I, I remember. I, I lost it in a scuffle with a, a dog. Oh, oh yeah. When was it? Oh yes. Probably Einstein. The day that speakeasy burned down. <laughs> a speakeasy. Uh -huh. Valley. Don't act so surprised, young man. Your generation doesn't hold a copyright on moral depravity, you know. Oh, yeah. Jesus. Sinister this is some deep stuff, guys. Hill Valley since the day it was founded. Um. What's. Should we see? Illegal speakeasy? Wow, a speakeasy. That must have been wild. Is it true they used to drink gin out of slippers like my grandma said? What the hell is a speakeasy? Don't I have no idea what a speakeasy is. Young man. Prohibition was a time when I thought a speakeasy. ruled the town while honest citizens quaked in their beds. I thought a speakeasy was where you where you just had a chat. You know, you went if you were bored, you went, hey, how's it going, guys? Had a rough day at work. You know, that's what I thought a speakeasy was. So where was it? That speakeasy that burned down, I mean. That was ages ago. If you're looking for bootleg hooch. No, I I'm just curious, that's all. I'm a, a student of history. Student of history. The voice history, of Martin in this is really good. Danny. Yeah, your generation of hooligans and slackers can oh. do two ripe things about history. Deep voice history? there. Oh, video store. Huh? The Speakeasy used to be hidden in plain sight down there in the town square, right where that disgusting videotape rental store squats today. Uh huh. So the video store building must have gone up after the speakeasy burned down. The following year, as I recall. So I guess we're going back then. Right, so what's with all the newspapers? newspapers, honey? This is my personal archive. I've got every issue of the Hill Wait. Valley Telegraph ever published. Get, Get out. out. Every single what? issue. 
from 1871 to the present. If it happened in Hill Valley, you'll find it in my stacks. Yeah, you could also get those in a library. To I be honest, somewhere in these stacks, there must be an article about the speakeasy burning down. Naturally, yeah, I probably wrote it myself. I was quite a reporter back in the day. Yeah. You know what date that article came out? About well, cats, probably. Obviously, the day after the speakeasy burned down. Right. Um. Okay. Let me go away. I don't want to talk to you anymore. Let me Silly keep you from your business. I want to see if I can have a look at these newspapers again. You there! Don't even think about tossing that <clears throat> Kleenex wow. on the ground! <laughs> okay, right, let's see. Can we get more... Can we read more newspapers? Is it just going to be the same thing? Don't touch those! What? My newspapers are in pristine ah, hold condition hold on, hold on. and meticulously organized. Not about to let some street punk get jam all over them. Whoa. Rumors about my jam hands have been greatly exaggerated. Right, if I if I poke this here. Then she'll think the kettle's boiled. The whistle. Surely the water's boiling by now. Right, get out of the room. I'm gonna look at your I'm gonna look I'm gonna rifle rifle through your papers. Quick, get to the fucking newspapers! Yes! Speak easy. Brown Mansion destroyed. 1962. No, no, that's not where Doc's stranded. Damn it. All right, Einstein brought me this shoe, and yeah. Miss Strickland lost the shoe on the day Put it the together, speakeasy Marty. burned down. But when did the speakeasy burn down? I at least need to know the year. Um. The year, the year, the year. Where would I find the year? Hmm. Maybe I could ask her. Any more of these pictures? Jeez, they all look like oh, they've got are. sticks up there. What's that, dear? Uh, look, there's um, there's a plaque. What's that plaque? That's what really. you get with these cheap. Ugh, she's back. Kettle. Let's see. Trying to find an well, we'll ask her again if she'll. We'll ask her if she will um Excuse elaborate me, on the Mr. year. Uh, when was the speaking? Video store building nope. must have gone up after. Damn it! The Shit, speakeasy wait. Speakeasy burned down. Ain't no. Following year is that? I space. Recall. Why does space pause the game? That's cool. Um. I guess someone. Naturally. Oh, it's right click. Yeah, it's the same. Well, Damn it! Well, it's the same dialogue it. options. Right. Let's have another look at these flipping papers. Is there anything else in her house? Why is she just let me walk around her house? It's very um. It's very friendly over. We don't want to go outside the street yet. Have a look around. Just mouse over everything. What's... Who's that fella? Marshall Strickland. My oh. grandfather. Gunned down by Mad Dog Tannen. Over oh, wow. 100 years ago. That's not how I remember it. Hmm. I don't recall that either, actually. Can I not get that? That's a picture, right? We don't want to see it. We've seen all the pictures, I think. Uh, candy, blah, 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 blah. I'm, gonna, I'm just going to get her sent out of the room again and see what we can do. Excuse me, my lady. I believe there's some tea you're boiling. There's the whistle. Yep. The water's yep, it is. On you go. Skip dialogue box, bro. You mads. Come on, go get some tea. God damn it. Go get my tea. No newspapers. Berman what have we got? plans for Lone Pine Mall. Peabody Ranch to be rezoned for commercial development. Come on. I don't even know Give me more than that. For clues in these stacks. Wish I could narrow it down to a year at least. Well, well, well how can I narrow it down to a gosh darn year? Oh, there's puzzles. So many puzzles. Stop looking at me. <laughs> Sorry. Um... I'm gonna write a Look. sternly worded letter of complaint. Sit down. Can you see anything else to click on, everyone? You guys know the answer, don't you? This happened in the last video. This is just a puzzler. But I think... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Maybe we can go to... Okay. Stop it. 
the doors of the street. Would you mind if I stepped out for a minute? I, I just remembered a video I've got. Yeah, we're going to go to the video I store. to go. I get so few visitors these days. Oh, Edna. And I'd hate to have to tell my brother. Your Whoa. vice principal in charge of discipline. Whoa. How rude you were to me. <laughs> Especially wow. with graduation coming up and all. Right, well, I guess it looks like we're trapped in Edna's apartment. Thanks, Edma. Thanks, Edna, you classy dame. God damn it, Edna. God damn it. Having a look through your goddamn binoculars. Whoa. February, look, 1932. How about that? I clicked around for like two minutes before I clicked on the binoculars. Fire must have happened before oh then. yeah. <laughs> when? I need a date. Don't look at me. I'm far too old for you. Shut up, Edna. You you don't look a day over ninety. Now excuse me while I turn your radiator on again. Get out of the room. There's the whistle. There's the Surely whistle. The water's boiling by now. Surely it must be Edna. How many times have you fallen for this, you silly old bat? Newspapers, go, 1932. Hello. Expo delights crowd. Soup kitchen exposed. Here uh -huh. we go. Speakeasy arsonist slain. Oh shit. Legal procedure gave way to old fashioned vengeance last night when a mob descended on the Hill Valley Police Station. The suspect in the speakeasy arson case, a drifter known as Carl Sagan, was Carl Sagan. His... Carl Sagan. It's Doc. Killed by a mob. What's the date? June 14th, 1931. Jeez, I gotta rescue him. Oh snap! My newspapers! Marty. Sorry, Miss Strickland. Uh, let me. Ow! You've gotten my history out of order. You idiot, Marty. You know how long it'll take to fix. What you've done! Ow! Oh, get out! Get out! Get out! I'm going. I'm sorry, Edna. Edna. Police! I'm being attacked by. Hooligans. No, you're not. No, you're not, Edna. Don't be silly. Come on now. Come on now, dear. Oh yeah. I think we're ready to go. Throw some stuff in the old fusionator. Hey. Where you been, son? And what are you doing in that getup? Right. I'm dressed up for a Halloween party, Dad. A uh, costume. Uh, tonight's the big uh, Halloween party. Of course it's the big Halloween, Halloween party. party. May? Yeah. Never mind. You don't have to explain. <laughs> yeah. Sure whatever it is you're up it's to, May. you know what you're doing, right? <laughs> I hope yeah, so. Yeah, man. I know what I'm hey, doing, bro. sometimes you got to go out on a limb for the ones you love, right? Wish my dad had understood that. Oh. Don't stay away too long. You'll barely know I was gone. Yep. Looks like it's time to go. Ready to go, Einstein? Hop in. Einstein, take the wheel. Alright. Everyone, thanks for watching. Me and Einstein are going to bid you adieu. This has been part two of Back to the Future. Join us next time, where we're going to hopefully engage these gosh darn time circuits. We're going to pump the time circuit switch. We're going to power up the flux capacitors. And we're going to go back to the past to rescue the dock. Um, if you enjoyed the video and you want to see more Back to the Future, then please click like on the video and share it with your friends by clicking favorite and dropping a comment. And of course, you can drop comments, of course, uh, about what you think of the series and, uh, and what you'd like to see next, of course. Ah, what a Friday it has been. So it's goodbye from me, the Nazinator. It's goodbye from Einstein, the Einsteinator. And it's goodbye from Marty, the Martinator. As we uh, bid you a good Friday and a good weekend. I'll speak to you soon, all. Catch you later. Bye. This is my outro song so that the vid doesn't end too who suddenly. Be sure to click like and faith and drop a comment if you think that you want to. Oh, oh, and there's tons of other stuff for you to click in the in the background for you. So go out, go ahead and do that. Thanks for watching the vid, you hootie for people. 
But that is all for now. Be sure to subscribe, and I'll catch you all later. Oh God! Bye. Seriously, why are you still watching this? Go and subscribe and drop a comment below. God damn you! Stop watching video. Click fave, drop a comment, I think you want to, but if you don't, well, that's your opinion, I guess. Careful, Marty. Careful, son! Shit, man. Careful now. It's cold. You knew that. Why do you seem to have forgotten? Oh, shit. Einstein. Where do you come from, boy? Didn't you bring Doc with you? Jesus, there's a dog in there. Goddamn mutts. Keep these mutts out of my car. It was, of course, Doc Brown's dog, uh, Einstein. What I've learned from the comments section in the previous video is to use a mouse, which I'm going to do, because you guys were completely right. I would have found those amp controls so much faster if I had been using... Um, a mouse, so I'm now going to use a mouse, and um, and yeah, let's just rock, and um, let's find out what's in this a DeLorean uh, over here that suddenly is back from looks like it's from the 19 uh, well it's it's from the it's the 2015 right is that what year it was when he went to the future because it's got a Mister Fusion there at least so let's see what's going on in the Dark. DeLorean. Oh, he's reminiscing. What is shoe? Was oh, that his mother's okay, shoe? Doc, I know I haven't seen you in a few months, but I'm pretty sure this isn't your shoe. Yeah. Oh, a tape recorder. That's probably gonna have. To... That's probably plot. Let's see. Um. I can use those to enter a date into the time circuits. I know. We know. We know what's going Marty. on. Ah. Oh. Marty, if you're hearing this recording, then the DeLorean's automatic retrieval feature is a resounding success. Automatic retrieval? In case of my oh. failure to return to the DeLorean within an allotted time, I programmed the time machine to jump to these four dimensional coordinates. Happy Friday, everyone. It's Nazi here, and it's time to play some Back to the Future, the game. Continue. This is us loading the game. I guess. <laughs> Hope you're all doing fantastic. I'm doing pretty darn well. Whoa. Okay, good. I, I was like, where are you loading me from, game? So, hi everyone. Marty's trying to wave, but he can't. Hey guys, how's it going? Thank you so much to everybody for your huge response to my previous video, my previous Back to the Future video. I'm glad you enjoyed it so much. It was super fun, and uh, I'm going to play more. A few things... Without me, huh. as you are well aware, time travel is an inherently risky activity. And despite my elaborate precautions, there's always a possibility that I could land in trouble sometime. And that sometime is now. Or then. Or <laughs> maybe later. He's in trouble. Marty, you've come to my rescue in the past. Or oh, was it the future? Anyway, I'm relying on you to do it again. Please take the wow. story back or, or forward to whatever it is I'm stuck in time. When you get there, I'm sure you'll figure out what to do. That's mm. it? Aren't you going to tell me when that is? Just go to the date specified on the time certain readout under the heading mark last 